right folks, it hasn't gone to plan quite as what we'd hoped here in Valencia. 30 games in, we are still 14th in uh, La Liga. Um, we got 9 wins, 8 draws, 13 defeats. It's not great. Although, Real Madrid have had nine draws all season. They've only lost one though. Just three one to Celta Vigo. <laughs> that that is quite funny. So we are where are we? Fourteenth. Make sure I actually lined it up correctly. Yeah, there we are. Thirty five points. Eight games left to play. And that's what we're aiming for. It is possible. Ten points. You only need to win four games and you're already above the 46 point mark. So, we just need to win like every game on the calendar. So, I'll show you a couple of the results off camera. Yeah, last time out we showed you the games against Barcelona and Real Sociedad. Both lost it. We then lost 6-1, uh, 6-0 even to uh, Real Madrid. We then lost 2-0 to Sevilla. We beat Getafe by 2-0, and then we drew with Alaves 0-0. Which is a bit unfortunate. Um, did also play a couple of games with Switzerland, for anyone that is interested in that. And we beat Alba uh, we drew Albania 1-1, sorry. Um, and then we beat Germany. Germany in the mud, you'd love to see it. No, I have no idea what their, their team was. Um, they did not have, like, any... Let's have a look. Let's have a look at their senior squad. Like, this was their goalkeeper. I don't even know who he is. It's the same with this fella. Like, I have no clue what is going on here. Like, they've got this guy, and he's, like, reasonably good. But, I don't know. Why... Why did Germany not have, like, real players? This is the only guy that I could actually see, and he's amazing. Surumi. But anyway, let's uh, let's get into it. We're going up against um, Real Batiste today. So um, hopefully it's another win. What what are our results? What are our uh, last few games? We got Batiste, Valicano, Tenerife, Almeria. Vigo, Madrid, Espanyol, and Girona. Hmm. Interesting. Interesting indeed. Hopefully we can get some wins. But, um... No, it's definitely going to be a struggle. And it's definitely going to be... Um... <laughs> as long as they don't get sacked, it's going to be a season of change. This is Elliot Dumont. Yeah, I want him on my team, actually. He's a good player. Just going to get a quick scout report on him. Anyway, enough uh, mixing around. Let's get to our Robert Tees. Right, folks, this will be the team that we are going to go with. Um, apart from, actually, we're going to go two pressing forwards. We're going to go Gomez and Gonzalez, Ziyech, Fibas, Almeida, Press, Gaia, Dikabi, Sainz, Alvidi, and Lonan in goal. Actually, yeah, that'll be the one. No one has scored a huge amount. The only one that's actually got double digits is Gomez, with Gonzalez with six behind him. Casper Dolberg has only scored the one for us since coming in, which uh, you know isn't the best, but he's he's a decent option to have, and he'll uh, he'll go on the bench and should be somewhat good to come off. We've still got Conquado Guedes. I think I might chuck on for Los because he can play. I mean, he can't really play there. But he can play as a... No, false nine, maybe? If we need him to. But, uh... Yeah, we'll keep that, and we'll get into the game. First highlight of the game comes from us. We're going to play it out from the back. Phoebus gives it to Elvidi, who is, uh... He's quite tired, actually, so he will probably come off at half-time. 
Phoebus back to Almindra to press Diacabe. I'm going to go back to Lunan and Gull. Pass on up to Jose Gaia now. What can he do? Gets past one defender. Can he? That's a terrible cross. I don't think that was a cross at all. I think he went to shoot there. But it's unfortunate. Jose Gaia again. Can he get threat? Why is he going for... Why is he going for Gaia? We should be whipping in those crosses. We've got Ziyech who's injured as well. That's not helpful. It's going to be half time. It's going to be nil nil. We're going to tell the boys that was disappointed. I'm disappointed in everything that they're doing. So hopefully we can uh, do a bit better. Let's see some right. Guedes is injured, and I no. I'm going to put him in the middle. I want to put him in the middle. There we go. I'm going to put him in the middle as a false nine, just to see what that'll do. I don't really have anything to lose, really, so we need to uh, we need to win. And if playing three up front can help that, so be it. We will tell them to focus play through the middle because we have no wingers. Uh, Okie doke, Alvidi is now injured, which is great news. Um, cool. <laughs> Quiz is more. Can guy? No. Cool. That will, um. That's handy. Attacking fullback. We got Jesus Vasquez in. He's playing on the other side. We, um. I need the lads to show a bit of passion. Because it's going to be another nil nil. By the looks of it. Or it might not. What have we got? 90th minute winner? Come on, Jose. Diacabe to press. Gonna give this it out to Vazquez, who can't keep it, but oh, Nico Gonzalez. Yes, 88th minute. Please do not be offside. I don't believe that it would be, but you never know with these things, so come on. Vazquez makes a great save, but Gonzalez picks up the pieces. And we go up to 10th, which is good. I'll be happy if we can finish 10th or above, actually, after the uh, horrific season that we've had. Imagine that Andre Lunen making his 100th appearance for a club, whereas Tobias Press, 21, and he's made his 150th. The <laughs> it just goes to show how wasted Lunen was at Real Madrid. I'm pleased with your efforts, boys. Very pleased. And I'm pleased with your efforts up front. Good on us. Another win. It takes us up to 10th. The season doesn't look as bad now. But it's still pretty bad. It's still very, very bad. Uh, anyway, what does that put us on? 38 points. Still 10 points off 6th. So, yeah. But, catching up. That, that's what we want, and we have a relatively easy, apart from the Real Madrid game, relatively uh, easy group to get through. So, uh, anyway, let's get on to the next game. Right, folks, this will be the team Ocarique, Gonzalez, Los Cos, Benesa, Pitt, Press, Gaia, Diacabe, Sinez, Alvidi, and Daya, Lunan, Vasquez, Fran, Fibas, Almendra, Dolberg, and Gomez on the bench. Whew. Let's get into it. Unfortunately, uh, Hakim Ziyech is injured for, I think, up to 12 days, more or less. So, uh, yeah, hopefully. I don't do that. Roy Keane does this stupid thing. I don't. It's our, let's raise our game. And we'll tell all the boys I've got faith. Let's go. Alrighty, we are in the white, they are in the blue, and looks like we've got our first chance five minutes in, but Timothy Weyers just nicked it off us, and Valicano are going to counter. Oh, oh no. <laughs> Oof, that was lucky. Very lucky. Not sure what we are, what we're going to do if, uh, 
lose this, it would be very embarrassing. I would say, very embarrassing indeed. It's a penalty, thanks Nico LVD. Thanks mate. De Gea can't save it, we're 1-0 down, for goodness sake. Why were you always so useless? Useless. Oh, Nico Gonzalez goes close, but not close enough. All right, VD, make up for it, buddy. No. Oh, oh, it's a bit of a scramble. We've still managed to get it, though. Alex Pitt can't quite keep it low enough for David. Come on, Pitt. What can we do? Benesa to Nico. Jose Guy gives it up. Yes, David Okariki puts it in the back of the net. We're not done yet. Malakana are only two points ahead, so we'd actually go above them if we can win here. Great team effort to get back right at half time as well. Right at half time. Love that. Alrighty, we've got another highlight here. Benesa now. Ooh, so close. Good save from Fernandez. Ooh, right. We've got a corner now. What can we do? Can we put it in the back of the net? Dear Kabe. Gives it to Nico Gonzalez. Gives it to David Okariki. It's 2 1. Folks, we've turned the game on its head. We've turned the game on its head, and hopefully, hopefully, that's a win for us. Oh, good from David Okariki there. Hopefully I'm saying that right. Ninth position now. Oh, no, they've got a corner. Uh, oh, very close. I have taken off Loscos. And we are focusing everything down the left. Casper Dolberg has come on as a bit of a winger. So hopefully that sort of works. Not too sure. But, um... Yeah, maybe we should make a couple more changes. Let's get Vasquez in and let's get Fran in for Tiakabe as well. See what we can do there. New defense. Ooh, they're coming at us. They do not want us to win, but the clock's running down. Probably should have taken off LVD as he's a bit tired. Uh, don't really have too many right backs, but for a brilliant 2-1 win, we could do that. We can definitely do that. Very happy with that. I don't know why I'd say the performance was disappointing. I'm just going to say we got away with that. And I'm going to leave it there as uh, Nico is a bit confused. We did struggle a bit, but player of the match, definitely David here. And yes, new boss splashes of the cash. It is perhaps an indication of how much wants to make by slashing 55 million on the capture of inside forward Ruben Fargas from Norwich. Yes. Yes. Um, unfortunately for Ruben Fargas, he's played three games. Yeah, I think I might have spent a bit too much. I will praise David, actually. He was superb in front of goal. Thank you, buddy. Very much appreciate that. We'll send the assistant. We're going to continue on. What else do we got to do? 12 days till our next game. <sighs> right, we seem to be packing up the form a little bit. It's been um, a couple of good games. Should be an easy couple of games against Tenerife and Almeria. Almera. I think I'll bring it back for the final three games. Real Madrid, Espanyol and Girona. Uh, until then... Leave a comment, leave a like, subscribe, and we'll catch you in the next one. Peace. Thanks for watching.